Hi friends, welcome to MSC videos. In this video, we have to solve this problem. Determine the six digit integer, no leading zeros, which means that the first digit does not contain any zero. No digit may be repeated and digits may be repeated. For these two questions, we have to uh, consider the extra condition that six digit numbers are even, also six digit numbers are divisible by five. So let's solve this problem. No digit repeat means first we are not having zero is possible. So there are nine digits are allowed. Second digit, this first digit can't occur here so there are nine possibilities and here you can't have these two digits so eight here you can't have these three digits so seven six five so this is how no digits are appearing even digits are always ending with zero two four six eight so we will separate the zero zero if we have, if a number is ending with zero means at last we are having only one possibility is there which means that it is ending with zero and then starting number you can have numbers from one to nine and here we you can't have zero as well as this number so 9 into 8 for this position you can't have this number this number and this number so 7 and here we are having four possibilities are cut out so this is the value so if you are ending with 2 4 6 8 means there are last position we are having four possibilities and here we are having 8 which means that 0 is not possible along with that 0 the last digit is also not possible so here where it is 8 and second digit the last digit is not possible and the first digit is also not possible so here we are having it is 8 7 6 5 and then we are getting this either it may be ending with 0 or it may be ending with other elements so we are adding these two values we are getting this answer and then another one condition is divisible by 5 divisible by 5 means it will be ended with 0 so already we calculated for ended with 0 if it is ended with 5 means last digit is it should be 5 first digit you can't have 5 as well as you can't have 0 and here you can't have this number as well as this one and for this digit you can't have this one this one and the last one so we are getting this so divisible by 5 is either it may be ended with 0 or ended with 5 so here we are having this answer another one is divisible by 4 so within 100 divisible by 4 it can be ended as 0 0 0 4 up to 96 so last two digits having 0 which means that last two digit having 0 so last two digits are fixed so 8 7 into 6 into 5 into 6 so we are having this last two digit not having 0 so which means that these values that is 12 16 24 28 these values there are 16 possibilities are there so last two digit having 0 we are having only 6 possible which means that 0 4 0 8 20 40 60 and 80 there are 6 numbers are there and here 16 numbers you can't have 44 and 88 because the numbers are repeating so 16 numbers so 0 is not possible here last two digit is not possible so 7 into 7 into the values we can get these values and then if the digits are repeating means it is a simple problem so always you can't have 0 at the first position so 9 into all the digits can be repeated so 9 into 5 if the even numbers are there means last we are having only 5 possibilities here also it can repeat divisible by 5 last we are having only 2 possibilities you can use divisible by 4 means last we are having 25 numbers are possible because 0 0 to 96 so there are 25 numbers are possible so you can identify the answer if you are having any clarification put the question in the comment box all the best for your examination thanks for watching thank you